Now, Patrick, why are you here? Well, I really shouldn't be. There's nothing wrong with me, but the thing is, I'm invisible, so... Invisible. Yep, ever since I was born. Yeah. Push, come on! You, you can do I'm this! Push, push, like a bird class. Push, come on, come on. push! Come on, I'm push! You can do down. this! Push! Push! Wow, that must have been pretty hard for you to grow up like that. It wasn't too bad. I had some pretty good times when I was younger. Oh, the baby baby. Oh, how cute are you? Oh, yes. What a sweetheart. Oh, so Really? I guess it can be pretty tough being invisible sometimes. Because? There are many things that make the invisible life a challenge. So here we are essentially inside this box, doctrine, authority, tradition, trying to break out and then ultimately reach this oversoul. So, class, if you need help, who are you going to call? Oh, Patrick, who are you going to call? I don't know. Who are you going to call? Don't do this again, please. Are you saying there's no upside to being invisible? I mean, I guess there are some positives about being visibly impaired. Visibly impaired would imply that you're blind. You do not know me. You don't know that you don't know me. Anyways, I can cut the lines at buffets. I don't have to worry about skin care, clothes. To be honest, I'm, I'm actually naked right now. And I also have a pretty cool invisible club. Invisible club. Yeah, it's a support group I go to. We talk about all the turmoil and angst facing fellow Invisians. Good. Tell me about these, uh, problems you talk about. Order, 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 order! We got a lot on the agenda today, guys. Mike, item number one, how are the uniforms coming? Great. We're gonna have a bake sale next week to raise some funds. All right, make sure you let everyone know the date by putting an announcement in the Invisible Bulletin, okay? Keep those brownies away from me. I'm watching my figure. <laughs> it's funny because you're invisible. Gee, uh, we're out of time. And I have another appointment coming in. Uh, what I would like, Patrick, is for you to come in next week so I can see you then. Funny. What? I get it. You'd like to see me next week, but I'm invisible. Real funny, Doc. Whatever. Bye. What kind of doctor are you? 